So we're here at Spencer Shops. So here's the front. Over there is Little Choo Choo. I did a video on that. There's Little Choo Choo Shop. This is Spencer. This is where they keep the in Norfolk and Western 611, which is a J class, and it's the only one around. So here's um some old spikes. I know you definitely can't. Well, you can keep that. So this is the switch. Pretty big. So we're gonna walk up here. So yeah, that's a D rail. Yeah, that's a D rail. Well, anyways, I just found a loose railroad spike that I am gonna keep. That is oh. Let me go ahead and show my papa. Hey Papa, look what I found. A railroad spike. Now I'll keep it. I pulled it out of the track. It was just one cross ties. There's real. So, Luke, we're not. So, a lot of people use those for uh, flower gardens. Yeah. But they're heavy. Yeah. So, those, those are cross ties of you. Now, these rails are real heavy. Rails weigh, these rails weigh like over 100 pounds. Where? Right down there. Yeah. Oh yeah, my brother's gonna get this one. See, you gotta pull real hard. Just pull it out. It should be rotted good enough. It don't matter. Only keep one. Okay. Take it. Now. Take it. No, that's just a derail. That's just for a derail. So, anyways. So, this is the track I believe the 611 runs on. Maybe. I just know there's something. I know that there's just a thing. Wait one second. Wait one second. I'm going to see if you can actually do this. I know how to operate one of these. No, but I know how to operate one of these. I just... Yeah, I can't do it. Anyways, well, we came here last night to, so, um, for the, um, Christmas lights. You have um, bigger pockets. Hmm? You have bigger pockets. Right. Maybe, never mind. Here, I'll put it with So the there's, place. never mind. There was that here when me and Wyatt came. It's like an old fire truck. Yeah, truck. yeah, it's an old fire truck. Um, so here's the roundhouse. And they're, oh, they're doing, um, they're getting, letting people are. Over where? Um, that's the round. That's the turntable. Now I believe on a video it said it's like the only lasting roundhouse in the United States, in the world, or so. I don't know. But I know this is old. So we're gonna walk over and look at the 611. For now, you can. We're gonna go um look at the 611 first. What? Oh, you know what? Yeah, let's go this way. There's the turntable. They got engines out from last night. There's the engines. They got them tucked in there. We're gonna go see the 611. Here comes the good parts. Where the 611 is up in here. So, Walking in here. There's a 611. 
So there's a caboose. And there's that little roundhouse over there. But here's the 611. Right here. And I'm gonna go ahead and put this right here so y'all can go ahead and maybe take a screenshot of that and read about it. So this is the front of it. So I wanna show you how big these wheels are compared to my hand, okay? Here, they're just giant. They're just, hold on, hold on. Me and me, y'all, against here on this other train. Hold on. Look at me compared to these wheels. Look at me compared to these wheels. This is how big this engine is. It's real big. So, if y'all are wondering, like, what this stuff is, like, Right here on, on a steam engine, like that big silicone, that's the firebox. I don't know how much foot that firebox is. So, there's the wheels under the cab that, and it's trying, I believe, if I'm it's hard to get correct, this right here is employees in here right now is where um, the coal comes through. Yeah, that's another, there's other steam engines out there. But there's how big the tender is from there all the way to there. Here, Papa, I'll stand by the tender so we can, a grown adult compared to its tender. Here, here, grown adult. Well, I gotta get back for this cause it's so big, hold on. A grown adult and little kid compared to that tender. That's huge. And the engine is twice, I think twice that size. Now, here's a diesel. Wait, this might actually, I don't know. Wait. Oh, you know what? That's a steam engine. That's some type of steam engine. I did not know of, but let me tell you this, it's a big piece of history, I can tell you that. That is a big piece of history right there. It has had wheel slips, I know that. But, look at that. So um, we've actually rode in the cab of this before, and you can, but it don't count, it costs over a hundred, at least, just to get into this engine, over a hundred. So if I get, There's the inside. Now this is a, I think this is an extremely weird steam engine. It is, cause it is. Like you don't see that every day, but it's here at Spencer. Now.
I'll do another video of, of what is inside of them. Not gonna be part two. There's its brake shoes. Over okay, the front, I think it's got like a sander or something like that. So, ooh, now here's something cool. Not really. Something like that. It is um, a water tender. It's the Norfolk and Western water tender is what this is. Or maybe a baggage, I don't know. But I know it's something like a water tender. That's kind of cool. This is, um, what, like one of those, um, this is a Piedmont Northern. Let me get up on him. It's look inside of them. It's hard to. Oh, that one might be a power. It might be for extra power. So, let's get down. I'm going to show y'all. So, I'm sorry that I'm having to put y'all down a walk. That's the way you have to get down from this. That's the way you have to get down. So I believe that might be like, oh, you know what that is? That's um, one of those engines that you use for like the overhead power. But it's coming here. There's something old. But in here, in this particular, particular or whatever, room um it is kind of echoey echo the i want to show you, this is basically what the inside of a tender would look like so basically it's a thing of somebody drilling and they're holding and he's holding it so that's where the firebox holes would be so let's come back out here to the train cars. See you in part two.